To Mezgin Turinet, the Director General of the National Intelligence and Security Service, has this morning vowed to eliminate the Tigray People's Liberation Front and its ideologies. The intelligence chief has also ramped up a searing criticism of foreign countries which he blamed were rescuing the TPLF. In a statement he issued on his Facebook page, Temesgan, who was the former president of Amhara State, accused the TPLF as a party which committed a cascade of unlawful acts starting from walking out of the incumbent's prosperity party to relying on coalescing federalist forces to challenge the federal government and overstepping its mandates by conducting regional elections without the consent of the federal government. Temesgan said that the last unlawful act of the TPLF was when it attacked the Northern Command of the Ethiopian National Defense Forces. Even after the unilateral ceasefire was announced by the federal government, the TPLF crossed the line with its invasion of the Amhara and Afar regions and is committing atrocities against innocents. Temesgan promised to take all the necessary measures to protect the security of the country. It is proven that conspiring to destroy a generation unless the TPLF is in power is not going to work, he said, and added that it is also proven that such mentality is not limited only to a few thugs, swindlers, liars, murderers, vagabonds, and terrorist pensioners. In his criticism of foreign countries, Temesgan said that ironically those claiming to be the world's police, the so-called educators of democracy, the ones who claim to have stood up against unjust world order failed to condemn TPLF, and its deeds from conspiring to dismantle our country to its blatant acts of atrocities against innocents, looting, and invasions it is committing. Let alone condemning, these countries are helping the TPLF including feeding it, providing medicine, communication equipment and providing arms," he said, and added, as if that was not enough, it's heartaching to see them engaged in criticizing, agitating and threatening the government.